A follow up now on Ellie's Donuts decision to end police and military discounts, which set off a social media firestorm over the weekend. As Iowa News reporter Courtney Carter tells us, the owner went on social media to further explain his decision. The owner of Ally's Donuts says it's been quite a weekend for him. In a 14 minute Instagram video, he says he stands by what he said, but he wants to clarify that he's not anti military or anti police and apologizes to those that feel insulted. Owner Matt Drescher first took to social media to announce he would no longer be offering a police and military discount on donuts. The North Kingstown Donut Shop says it's a sign of support for the Black Lives Matter movement. The opinions from those who agreed or disagreed on social media were quick and swift, so much so that the owner released a follow-up video explaining himself on Sunday. That message didn't really convey my intention. Um, I just wanted to take away a privilege from people uh, so that we could all be equal. After apologizing to those who took it as an insult, in the same weekend that customers showed up in line holding Black Lives Matter signs, he explained he is not anti-police or anti-military and even has service members in his own family. And they made a decision in their lives to sacrifice for people they don't even know, for strangers. And um, that's respectable. But the owner says despite clarifying himself, he is still standing by what he said. And if you're quiet, you're part of the problem. And nobody talks about it. And why don't we talk about it? Encouraging everyone to start a conversation. Let's talk about things. You know, people in power, people with influence. Let's discuss how to fix things. Let's acknowledge that they need to be fixed and not ignore it. For people, we got power to do anything we want to. We send a person to the moon. And while Ali says they still sold out of donuts this weekend, the decision led some local individuals and groups to hand deliver donuts to local police in a challenge called Hashtag Donut Challenge to show their support. I'm Courtney Carter, Eyewitness News.